Heights. And the storm is gaining strength and creating more hazards with each passing hour. NBC Bay Area's Marianne Favreau is near Highway 17 in Los Gatos. We've seen a heavy downpour here the last three hours and here off Highway 17 they've put up an electronic billboard warning drivers that the roads are extremely slick and they need to slow down. Tonight, drivers navigating Highway 17 in a downpour. With the Santa Cruz Mountains expected to encounter the brunt of the storm, people in Ben Lomond prepped for the worst. Anything can happen here, you know, and particularly wintertime. We get a lot of rain compared to a lot of other places. The big concerns? Flooding and high winds topping 30 miles an hour. I've got some roofing nails here, and I'm going to uh, tack down some of my uh, flashing and roofing material. At this hardware store, tarps sold out. We see a lot of people getting tarps, preparing for the rain, a lot of plumbing just in case. Definitely tarps, batteries, and honestly water because everything shuts down completely. In Santa Clara, Great America shut down its Winterfest event tonight because of the storm. Christmas in the Park in downtown San Jose, however, is open tonight. Crowds bundled up to check out the holiday displays, braving rain and chilly temperatures that felt even colder thanks to the high winds. I am really cold. I mean, it's super, I'm not used to it, so it was super cold. I have like three layers of shirts on, but my sweater. Which explains why the hot cocoa line was so long. But for some, even the heavy rains did not dampen their holiday spirit. Christmas is Christmas, and I think even when it's raining, like you find the joy in it. In San Jose, Marianne Favreau, NBC Bay Area News. Love the positive attitudes out there. And we want to see what the rain looks like in your neighborhood. Send us photos and videos of what's outside your window. Just tag NBC Bay Area and we may put them on air.